What's up, Intro Web? This is 100 Intro Media Gaming, and let's start off with this video. PlayStation 4 Pro will support SATA 3 hard drives. Uh, I guess um, the, earlier this week, a Japanese website, um, 4gamers.net, had an interview with Sony, and they clarified that it will support SATA 3 hard drives, unlike the PlayStation 4 Slam and also the regular OG PlayStation. Um, for those out of the loop, the SATA 3 standard has a maximum data rate of 6 gigabytes per second would result in faster loading and game install. And so that should be a good upgrade. The current PlayStation 4 only supports SATA 2 model, which threshold is 3 gigabytes per second. Okay, you guys don't want to know what SATA is. That's what you connect your hard drives to. SSD drives run off of SATA. Um, the old was... IDE. That's when I went to school and we started on IDE hard drives. That's cool for it's cool for Sony. It's cool for Sony that's supporting um, a faster data rate hard drive. Ugh. But I have one question, and you know I have to pull the rabbit out of my ass. Okay, you guys understand when PC guys understand this, you know what I'm saying? The average computer don't understand this. And I was trying to tell my boy that he was like, man, my sister this had her uh, PlayStation 4 and put a 4 terabyte in it and all this other shit. I'm like, kudos, but why should you have to open up your console? You guys don't know, our body builds up static electricity. So if you rub your foot on your carpet, you can build up static electricity. Most techs like me and stuff like that, to, pervert, to prevent that, um, we put on static gloves or, you know, wrist straps to absorb the static electricity because you don't know that you building up static electricity you can burn out motherboards and you can fry hard drives and do you believe sony will compensate you on that come on look at the history of sony if you decide to open up your playstation 4 pro and you didn't have the static gloves and stuff like that and you fried that motherboard do you really think that sony is going to give you another playstation 4 pro no so you see how microsoft decided to you don't even have to even crack your machine open we made it where you can just go get a usb 2 usb 3 external drive plug it in whatever usb port that you have in your xbox one xbox one s and voila why can sony do that you know what i'm saying you guys saying you know how sony can actually put real native you know hdr in the playstation 4 um slim in the og 4 why they cannot do that why you have to open up your system why they cannot make the playstation 4 take hard drives now it does take hard drive but you cannot load no games on there no games so for one is how big the hard drive going to be in that bad boy are they going to have different models get a terabyte you get two terabytes right now i'm gonna tell you right now a one terabyte hard drive ain't shit compared to these games you got battlefield 130 i mean not battlefield but call of duty if called the new call of duty is fucking 130 gigs halo is shit's over 100 gigs shit gear is probably gonna be over 100 gigs but microsoft was giving you an option i have a four terabyte that i'm probably half through probably gonna get me another one I spent 120 bucks on it but to me it was worth it plus I still have the five gigabytes that I don't use so why can Sony get the secret sauce and cut on the switch and allow people to buy external hard drives instead of opening up the PlayStation 4 and you have a liability and you might have close to your ass voiding your warranty or Sony's not going to fix it. You know Sony track record ain't that good of helping their consumer out. That's all of them. Jitty, how much further Come do on. Keep? Keeping it 100. Sure, but we'll hit that museum first. Okay. PlayStation Sorry, Nation. No why have you never... Why, have well, you even asked for this? We get it. We didn't ask for it and got it. 
Why should you have to open up your console? It's supposed to be closed environment. But this your boy. Tell me what you think. Comment below. Go check out us at IntroMediaGaming.com. I'm out this mofo, man. Y'all keep it 100 with yourself.